up? Uh, I know it's been a minute since you ever seen me. About two months, actually, you know. Got my hair since, you know. <sighs> two months ago, I told y'all that I wasn't okay. And, you know. I mean, this, this is gonna be this, this is gonna be an update video. It's gonna this, this is an update. I'm doing a, I'm doing okay. I'm, I'm I'm a little bit better, you know. Things still aren't exactly what I want want them, want them to be. But hey, that's 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 life, you know. Um, I think I told y'all for the first time a couple months ago about my mental health and you know how you know. How it's going, how it's bad, you know. It's still bad, but I just, I wanted to give you guys an update because I feel like you guys deserve an update. I know Terry, he's been here making videos, you know, holding the channel down while while I've been absent. Um, shout out to Terry, by the way. <laughs> mm. It's, it's 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 been a it's it's been a time it's been a time and a half to say the least um things still like i said things are still aren't where i want them to be but every day trying to pro progressively get better um i've been trying i've been doing things you know to try to you know help out mental health wise, you know, dye my hair again. I don't know if I remember my hair being green one time in the past few years ago. Been to the gym, you know, um, lost a little weight, you know, you know, working out a bit. Um, I'm moving soon. Yeah. Moving soon. Um, hopefully next month I'll be moving. Um, so this place that I'm in now, I won't be in. Hopefully, think fingers crossed. Um, uh, I will be back making videos soon. I will be doing that. I don't know when, but um, hopefully it'll be sometime soon. Um, and get a few more off days from work. I'm I'm off today, off yesterday too, guys. Just, no, I didn't have the energy to put this out for you guys. So I'm doing it today. Um, so I know I owe people videos. I know people have been requesting videos. I will try to get to those when I can. I know there's been a lot of new stuff that's come out. I will try to get to that as soon as I can. There's been a lot of things with wrestling that's been happening. It's been a lot, so um, I will try to get as much content as I can for you guys soon. Um, but this is not, it's right now, it's not really about that. Um, it's about me and you because, especially all the guys out there, you know, June is men's mental health month. I know, speaking on that, at least. From my perspective, I know we don't get a lot of love when it comes to mental health. And I know there are a lot of people who are like me who don't tell people about their struggles because, you know, as men, you know, we tend to assume that a lot of people don't care. And sometimes it turns out to be true. You know, people tell us to speak up. We speak up. And then nothing happens because they say you're a man, you should get over it. Like, so what was the point of me speaking up to begin with? It, 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 that's one of the things that happens, you know, unfortunately. Fix the camera for a little bit. But man to man, talk to, talk to people about your problems. Just do it. I'm doing it right now with you guys right now. Um, it's not the most ethical way to do it, but I'm doing it anyway, you know? I feel like you should have that outlet, you know? Have, 
at least have someone to confide in, whether that be, or, you know, brother, sister, significant other, best friend. You can you can talk to the boys about it. You know, it doesn't matter who it, who that person is. You can even do what I'm doing. You can sit in front of a camera and you can tell other people, you know, what's going on. Because you'll because you'll be surprised as to who reaches out and you know who can give you that advice. <clears throat> I know mental health is a serious subject. Obviously, we know that. But I feel like it's good to talk. It, it's it's a it's good to talk about it, even though you you might not do it all the time. Like every now and then, every now and then, to have someone to talk about those problems with, you know, it can like it can be someone that like your your main group of people don't even know about, you know. It can be someone like as long as you have that person to confide in, even just have that one person. Because I I know of wanting to go through everything and do everything yourself, but sometimes you do need help. You know, not ashamed to admit that sometimes I need help, even though I know speaking on my personal experiences, I'm gonna do it on my own. That's just me. That's just how I am. Don't do what I do. <laughs> Don't do what I do. If you know people are willing to help, have them let them help you. <clears throat> um, I, I feel like in the past I have let people help me, which has benefited me, but I know I still go back into that same pattern of trying to want to do things on my own. And you know, it is tough. I'm pretty sure y'all know it's tough as well. Don't do it on your own. Have someone to talk to. Have someone help you. I know um re there there are resources out there, but like also I, I understand like this this the actually it's it's the reaching out part. It, that I feel like that's that's the part that holds a lot of us back. It's the reaching out part. That's the thing that gets it for most people, you know. But I feel like once we jump that first huddle of not huddle hurdle of actually reaching out to someone, I feel like it'll get hopefully it'll get easier from there. Hopefully. Because 2024, it, it is hard. It is hard. With everything going on, like, it's, no, like, no matter where you are in work, I know we have people who watch this channel from, like, everywhere. Um, no matter where you are, I'm, everyone's situation is different. But don't let this situation... <laughs> dictate how you're you go through your life you know don't let the situation dictate how you perceive things you know because one thing that helps me i think about all the good things that have happened and that could happen you know in the future because i'm still trying to pursue what i want to do you know I'm, I still want to start my training for wrestling. Obviously, I haven't started that yet. Um, can't afford it right now, but uh, but I'm trying. You know, step by step, I'm. I know I'm gonna get there. Step by step, and I know whatever your your dreams that you want to achieve, take a step by step. Don't try to rush it. Take your time with it. Because that, because trying to rush it, it 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 could backfire, and I would want I would want you to like have your dream slip from you, because you because you rushed it and you didn't think things through properly. 
because I think that was a problem I did. I tried to rush my dreams, and you know, I can't can't always do that. But guess what? I'm I'm gonna keep pursuing them though, because you got to get back up every single time. That's why, like, I have the YouTube as an outlet. I have the you guys as an outlet because you guys motivate me. You know, hopefully, I can motivate y'all to like pursue what you want to do. You know, and I'm doing this thing where I rock back and forth again because you no, know, it means a lot to me. It does mean a lot. You guys mean a lot to me as well. You know, I do appreciate you guys for reaching out in the previous video I did two months ago. Um, it really shows how you guys do care, you know, and I do appreciate you guys a lot. <sighs> I'll be back soon. I'll be back. But just know, um, I'll keep updating you guys about how things are going periodically. You know, we, ha we have our sit down talks like this take care of yourself and i'll try to take care of myself too i'll see you